whole thing started in World War One. What is Cinemascope? The anamorphoscopic lens for the Cinemascope system. We see more horizontally than vertically. Cinemascope is destined to bring a new era in the motion picture. Nice flares, great image quality. We refuse to settle for something secondary. Hey guys, Chit of Headings here. I think we all agree that shooting anamorphic gives your footage a truly cinematic feel. It's a total game changer from shooting spherical, and it's the one thing big budget productions hold above our heads, feeling just out of reach. Did you know it takes an indie filmmaker between a year to a year and a half, on average, to build a reliable anamorphic rig and start shooting high quality footage? In fact, most people don't even take the first step into it because it sounds too complicated. Another big chunk gives up after buying their first lens and failing to achieve the look they want because they don't know how to build their setup properly or improve its performance. They don't know if they need new clamps or diopters or if they're doing something wrong in post. Starting to shoot anamorphic on your own is like trying to cook a complex dish without knowing the recipe or the ingredients. If you wanna make your way into a big budget look without the downside of spending a ton of money buying lenses until you find one that you like or bashing your head against the keyboard because the footage doesn't look right in the edit, don't despair. That's the whole idea of shooting anamorphic on a budget. You need to learn how to optimize the gear you already have and buy only the absolute essentials to create a killer lens and camera setup capable of delivering the big budget look that you crave. That's what I've been doing on this channel for the last five years. I've reached thousands of people with the videos and personally helped hundreds by answering questions about their setups. More recently, I've also worked in partnership with several brands in our niche, such as Sirui, Vazen, Schneider, Ironglass, SLR Magic, and others to improve their products for us. Although the trial and error method of going through various anamorphics still works for some people, it has become less and less effective because, well, it takes a lot of time and there are a lot of lenses out there. So many actually that it causes analysis paralysis because you're about to buy something and then you wonder, but what if that one is better? Some of you like Timo Ichido or Ichidomo have been catching up and figuring out what works for your style while keeping the budget in check and shooting gorgeous anamorphic footage. Independent filmmaking has become more competitive than ever, and it's hard to be different from the other players. Everyone has the same cameras, RED, Blackmagic, Sony. Everyone has the same lenses, contact size, Rokinon, Leica Rs. You want to improve your production value while keeping the costs down. Did you ever stress about making your films look unique compared to other studios or filmmakers near you? Or you want to move into a higher bracket and be able to charge better for delivering more expensive looking results? How much time do you spend uh, looking for ways to make your footage look more cinematic? This was my life back in 2012. Now, with a streamlined approach to budget anamorphic shooting, you can finally learn how to achieve your cinematic look all in one place. Yep, you're right. It's right here. So, if you're not a subscriber yet, you're missing out. Here are the top three reasons why you should fast track your way into anamorphics. Production value. Anamorphics literally saved Hollywood from going bankrupt in the 50s. They've been shooting scope for decades now and just raking in the profits. Two, anamorphics help making connections. Tell any camera person or even most directors that you shoot with an anamorphic rig and they'll instantly start asking about it and try to set up a meeting to see it in action. I've actually gotten a lot of jobs this way. Three, get ahead of the game. While other players are still trying to figure out their setups on their own, you won't be fiddling with several lenses until you find the one that works for you. Get the right scope from the get-go and get out there to shoot cinematic footage. Since you're watching this video, there's a high chance you already started into anamorphic shooting. I'm also willing to bet you don't trust anyone else 
with your rig because of all its quirks and details. That's just a fancy way of saying issues. Imagine walking onto set with it and just handing your build to the camera assistants. Imagine not wasting a single minute of the shoot on some random issue that never popped up before. Or my favorite, not having to ditch the anamorphic completely because too many random issues came up all at once. I had to do that a handful of times and it's the worst. Having confidence that the rig is flawless is key for taking it to paid shoots and having clients and producers wanting to shoot more. In the next video, I'm gonna show you how you can get started streamlining your anamorphic shooting, putting aside all the what ifs and what's the best insert piece of gear here out there. Let's be real. If we wanna hold on to our budget, we don't want the most wanted lenses. I get a ton of messages saying, what's the most perfect scope out there? And can I get it for 500 bucks? In the next video, I'll go through the priorities you should have in mind when choosing an anamorphic lens. It doesn't matter if it's your first or your 10th scope. The goal is to make this one a keeper. So make sure to subscribe now and don't miss the next video. I um, also got some exciting news for those who are serious about streamlining your anamorphic rig. Really soon, I'm going to launch the Anamorphic Cookbook course. To get updates about it, go to anamorphiccookbook.com and sign up for the mailing list. Become a member of the channel and you can get exclusive support on your journey, getting the full experience on how to go from no scope to a bulletproof anamorphic rig ready for production. If that's something you're interested in, make sure you click the join button below and check out the perks list. Membership costs as little as $3 a month, so it's like you're getting me a coffee and we're chatting about lenses. If you're still on the fence, just sign up for the mailing list at anamorphiccookbook.com for now. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, and if you have any questions, leave a comment, and I'm more than happy to help out. As I said, stay tuned for the next video because I'll be showing you exactly how to start saving time and money while getting ready to shoot scope. See you out there. Shit the fellings.